Good morning, everybody. I think maybe it's more like afternoon, but uh, yeah, I think it might be 12 o'clock. But anyway, it is May 5th. And today I had an unusual kind of thing happen. This uh, I was over at the bank getting Wi Fi, and this fellow came up to me, but he couldn't even really see much of me because I had my visor over towards the driver's side window to block some sun. There's actually sun today, which I'm grateful for. And uh, I was going to watch a video on YouTube. And he's kind of flagging me down and that, so I opened my window a bit and moved the visor and started talking to him. And before long, you know, I find out he's a homeless fellow. He wasn't... Uh, the whole time, though, when he talked to me, he never asked me for anything. I ended up giving a couple of oranges to him, and I had just a little bit of money in my... this little tiny purse that I carry with me. And I offered it to him. He never told him, you know, you can put it towards coffee or whatever. And he... Uh, then he asked me, before that even, before any of that, he asked me, you know, as we're talking, if I had a piece of paper and a pencil or a pen or, he said, even a red pen. But anyway, I had a pencil and some, I ripped out of this notebook, I have some kind of cardboard. And uh, he started drawing. And... Then he said he was an artist. <coughs> it was an interesting guy talking to him. And then he he was just standing there. He had crutches too. And he was drawing. And at one point he was holding one of the oranges. He put one in his pocket. And he was drawing away. Standing there. And he ended up drawing this. I don't know how well you can see it. And it was like a picture of me. But it was like I could see at one point he was holding it. To me, I could definitely see when I seen it kind of upside down. To me, it looked even more like me when I seen it upside down, which is interesting. And... Uh, So then I'm like, wow, that was interesting, uh, an interesting thing, but, uh, it was, uh, he did not want money or nothing, he wasn't asking for money, it was just an interesting encounter, and he's like, yeah, we're all connected, he was talking like that, which I already am in, uh, like, I mean, I'm, uh, I know that, like, we're connected, we are. Some people kind of, I'm in real realization of that, I should say. So, I ended up going down to the river and spent some time down there. And then I, he, he at one point, he asked me if I smoked, which I don't, and he asked me if I had a cigarette before that, he knew that I smoked or not. And I told him no. Anyway, I went back because there's a McDonald's really close to that bank where I usually get Wi-Fi. I'm at a different area right now. And I went into McDonald's because he was going there to warm up because it's, even though the sun's out and it's, uh, um, it's more... It's, we're going into warmer weather. Like, today is actually the last day of our, uh, you know, kind of cold snap that we've recently been having. And he was getting quite cold. His hands were getting quite cold. So, he told me he was going into McDonald's. So, I drove back there thinking, well, I'll get a, another cup of tea. And if the fellow's there, I'm going to offer to buy him a package of smokes. Because I know, you know, it was a cool picture I ended up with. And I thought... That was neat. So I did. I drove back, 
got myself a cup of tea. He was there. He was actually just leaving through another door as I got there. And I went over to him and I told him. And he says, I said, what kind of cigarettes would you like? I'm going to go get you a package. And he, even still, he's like, you don't have to. That's okay, type of thing. And anyway, he told me what kind he wanted, and I went and did that. And uh, I thought, you know, it's not what I would normally spend my money on, but this is kind of a neat thing that happened. I got that that nice sketching, and yeah, it was just, you know, you definitely meet interesting people in your travels and uh, just because he's a homeless fella doesn't mean he's any less important than any other person on the planet. I am houseless by choice. I'm not homeless because I have a van. I didn't tell him what I live and travel in here because when I f see certain like I come I, I live in the neighborhood area and I don't necessarily just tell anybody that I don't know in this area because I mean I'm coming and going always from this area but uh, it was just an interesting fellow and it was uh, a kind of a cool part of my day anyway then before long he's like you look like Candace Bergen Bergen I think it's Candace Bergen she was in a, a few shows I don't know yeah, I don't know. I have to, you know, just take these times in life that are kind of interesting. Makes you wonder. I'm like, wow. If I didn't go there, I wouldn't have that neat drawing. I hope you're all having a fantastic day wherever you are. And enjoying talking to people. And uh, share your smiles because they are good to receive one and it's good to give them out and we'll talk to you later